Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing an unboxing video and if I'm filming in a weird place it's because I'm filming in um, our living room. Okay, I hope this looks good, but yeah, I'm filming on my iPhone, so if the quality is not as good then I'm so sorry, I don't even know how I'm going to upload this. Uh, yeah, I ordered a Fjällräven Konken. Uh, in Swe I'm from Sweden so I know that you say Fjällräven and then Konken, but English people just say like Fjällräven and Kanken. Uh, but I'm really excited and I ordered it from Out North, so I'm just going to open it right now. Ooh. Oh my god! I love this colour so much. I ordered it in the colour Ochre? I don't know how you say it because it spells O-C-H-R-E. And yeah, I got it in the classic size because my little sister has a mini one and she's always complaining that it's too small, so... And my bag that I have right now, I got it from New Look. It was black. I did a video of it, like, what's in my school bag? But the handles are, like, because I carry so heavy stuff in it. Like, when I'm at my boyfriend's, I need to bring, like, everything with me. Uh, so I always put loads of heavy things in. Uh, so it's kind of breaking. So I figured I need a new bag that's going to last me forever. Because I know, like, loads of my friends have the Fjell Raven bags. And they last, like, for years, literally. And they're so durable. They're really um, strong and they handle a lot. So yeah, I really like this colour. I was debating on whether to get uh, the warm yellow colour. But I didn't like it because it was so... It was so yellow. It was like really bright yellow. And I didn't want it to be that bow outstanding. Um, and I had seen that there was other yellow bags that didn't look like that. And I was like, hmm, what can that colour be? And I found out that it was this one called Ocher. Ocher, I don't know. And um, it's more neutral and I really like it. And I don't think it's as popular as the warm yellow one. Which is also good because you don't want to have the same bag as everyone. But I still think this is quite a popular bag. <laughs> but yeah, I'm so excited. Now I'm going to take it out of this. How do I do that? It costed me around 800 kroner, which is around 80 pounds, which is really pricey. But it's a very good quality bag. And you can literally fit so much in it. If you want me to do a what's in my bag video, like a new video, like what's in my backpack video, tell me. So this is how it looks. It's really scrunkled up right now, but whatever. Hmm, it's got something black on it. It's got these notes on it. Shall I read it out? I'll just read it out. It says, in 1960, Åke Nordin founded Fjällräven in a basement in the Swedish town. Örnsköldsvik. Since then, we have stayed true to our mission, developing time, developing timeless, functional, and durable outdoor equipment, acting, acting responsible to people, animals, and nature, and inspire to a life outdoors. That's so cute. And then it just says a lot more here. Oh, it says this is the original version of the Konkin backpack. In 1978, we launched Konkin to prevent back problems amongst among Swedish schoolchildren. Many of the early Konkans are still in use today. By the way, did you know that the Konkan was the world's first climate compensated backpack? To avoid colour bleeding, we recommend that you rinse the backpack in lukewarm water. Take care when wearing it with light coloured clothing. I just, I've always wanted one of these. And there's a little black stain on my front pocket, which is really annoying, but... I mean, it's going to get dirty when I use it. And then there's a clip up up here, so you can you can carry it like this if you want. But I wouldn't. There's This is so good. There's a little water pack here. And the front pocket, I think I'm going to be using religiously. I always use front pockets a lot. There's stuff in there. Eh, there's a blue one. Here's the different, like, the Konken family. There's the Konken kids. Konken Mini, which is the one Sophie has. Original Konken, which is the one I have. There's Konken Big, Konken Laptop, Photo Insert, Maxi Konken, Chest Strap, and Shoulder Pads. So there's a lot of things you can like buy to it and loads of different ones you can get. And this is just that. And here's a little black stain I was talking about. It's like a smudge. Like there it is. You probably can't see very well, but it's kind of annoying me, so I'm gonna probably try and rub it off and now i'm gonna open the big pack look at that it's got so much big it's got such a big like thing so big <laughs> but this is gonna be really good i'm gonna bring this to america because like when i'm shopping i want to wear like a backpack because i find backpacks more comfortable and then you can write your name in there and then this is um a thing where you can have you can put your laptop in here i think the macbook 
Pro 13 will fit in here. This is one I've got. Um, I believe it will. I'm not 100% but I'm going to try that later when I get home to my mum's. And I think I'm going to leave this in for a while because it can be quite comfortable to have the um, padding on your back. Another thing I really love with these bags is that you can open them right down and then you can pack them really well. Like You can use up the space in the bag perfectly because you see where everything's going. I'm so happy with this colour, like literally. I'm so happy I didn't go for the sky blue one because that was the one that I was going for first. And I, I had really, I had like, I've been wanting one for ages, but then when I got my red bomber jacket, which is like about this colour, um, I was like, I don't know what will go with it. Um, so I was looking at blue and I thought blue might go. Um, and I was looking at green because r red and green are like, they're supposed to go really well. I looked at the colour circle. But then my friend had that green one, that the only green one that I liked, and my little sister's got a green one as well. And then I was like, to my friends, what about a yellow one? And everyone was like, yeah, yeah. And I was like, because mm. I really like yellow. If you haven't touched, if you can't tell, like yellow is my latest obsession because I've got it all over my Instagram. It's like my Instagram theme. But I'm so, so happy. I'm gonna go and get my jacket so you can see how it's gonna look. My cat's just been sitting there. I don't know if you've been able to see. Here's my jacket. And if anyone asks, it's just like the red bomber, a bomber jacket from Monkey. I think it's a Scandinavian like website. The colours, I think they go pretty well. I think they complement each other. And I like that it's like kind of red pinkish in here. Because then that kind of, it makes it look really cool. I need to adjust the back straps because they're a bit small. How on earth am I supposed to do that? There's a thing up here. Mm. I don't get this. Oh, it's just like, okay. It's really cool because there's like, you can strap the backpack thing there uh, if you want to actually it's a good size how it is I just thought it looked really small like the straps but it's good I'm gonna put it on oh no maybe it's a bit small I can't get my arm in there okay that's a bit small it's like on my head okay let's just change the length of the straps how am I supposed to do this though um, oh like that don't know how long I want them and now I can't strap those up there because because I just can't. I, I, the only thing I find a bit weird is that the straps will hang like that now. But, oh well. I don't know, I've been wanted to talk to you guys about this, but I just haven't. I've been really upset because re recently I've been having, like everyone knows I've got less views on my videos, but I mean, I don't really care, but I feel like you guys think I'm boring because I did, I have got a few comments like she grew up, she became boring, like she's boring now, she doesn't get as many views, blah, blah, blah. But I've just had so little time over for YouTube, like with my job, my school and like boyfriends and friends and like just having a social life, like but I also want to focus a lot on YouTube and I just haven't had the time to film like cool, art, like cool videos that I used to like lookbooks and out of the days and just like fashion videos so it has been that I've been just sitting down doing my makeup in front of the camera or just sitting down and talking to you guys or just like just sit down talking videos and I understand, I understand if you guys think they have become boring so please leave comment like requests videos down below because I really want to make content that you enjoy and if you want me to do vlogging in America let me know um, but I want to know kind of what kind of vlogs you want me to do. If you want me to do like the vlogs where I just film and then add music, like more artsy. Or if you want me to do like talking a bit and stuff like that. Um, also, I wanted to get a GoPro to vlog. But they're so expensive and I want to save my money for America. Like for shopping in America. Um, and my dad was like, the GoPros aren't that good because you can't like zoom in with them. But... I don't know, there's my cat. Leave requests down below because I really want to know. So yeah, I love you all and this bag is my new baby, so yeah.